afternoon baseball here on the show. Ought to be a good one here between the Chicago White Sox and the Texas Rangers. Next to bat will be Tim Anderson. He will lead this one off today. Off the afternoon for the White Sox. Rick Brookside. Tim Anderson. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Now a big fastball, and he's well behind it with the swing. Swing and a miss, and he's quickly in the hole. 0 and 2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. Now a swing and a miss on the slider as the leadoff man is set down on strikes to open up the ball game. The Coming to the plate now, Yomer, Yomer Sanchez, Sanchez looking for better results than last night when he went 0 for 4 in that one. And here's a slider that's nowhere close and it's 1 and 0. Our game time temperature pushing up close to 90 degrees, 89 degrees. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. And that is off the wall. Around second. He's on his way to third. The relay throw. But he is he in there with a triple. Batting third. The first baseman. Jose. So here's Jose Abreu. As the first pitch to him is in there for a called strike one. He's got the average of 285 here to start play. 25 homers and 59 RBIs. This one's down to third. There's Connor Falefa. Throw gets him. Two down. Now batting, Eloy Jimenez. Great chance to drive in a run here in the early going. Eloy Jimenez. First delivery to him on the way. Slider gets the outside. That's a strike. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Let's get it going, boys. Somebody's loose, hitting 98 with ease in the first inning. Fouled off. And a good fastball swung on and missed for strike three, and the inning is over. Into the box now, Albert Perez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The second baseman, Albert. Now the pitch. No ball, one strike. He's ready. Here's the 0 1. And boy, was he ever oh, fooled on that pitch. It's 0 and 2 now. Ugh, was that ugly? You could probably throw anything out there to this guy. He'd swing at the Raza bag if you throw it up there. The bouncer to the left side. Throw to first yeah. is in time for the first out. Stepping up to the plate, Julio Pablo Martinez. Julio Pablo Martinez. Here comes the first pitch. Bases are empty, one man out. Outside for a ball, one and one. Now a swing, and he gets him to pop it up. Anderson over to his right, and that's the second out of the inning. At the plate, Dominic Smith. He drove in two of his club's three runs in last night's affair. Outfield shaded toward right center. Here's the first pitch. Wouldn't mind the pitcher expanding the zone a little bit more and using his aggressiveness against him. And a pitch up and in, keeping him honest. One and one. One and one. One and two to Dominic Smith. One ball. One of the best ways to keep a guy uncomfortable is to pound him inside. They're doing that, and this one caught the zone. And he goes against the shift there as this is on the ground to the left side. The throw into second. Batting four. The right field. So here's Cody Bellinger. He's got that average up over 340 now with 40 home runs and 86 RBIs. And he fouls this one off. 
Here's the 0-2. And a fastball in the dirt that's taken for a ball. Not a real good pitch there, 0-2. Probably not what he was trying to do with that fastball. He was trying to miss probably up and away, and he threw that one down into the dirt on an 0-2 pitch. Very rarely are you going to get hitters to chase an 0-2 fastball that's down in the dirt. Full count to Bellinger. Three balls, two strikes. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. So here's Trey Mancini comes off an 0 for 4 in last right night's ball game. The right fielder, Trey Mancini. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Fouled away. Looking to put him away, here's the 0 2. Got to take advantage of that pitch right there. 0-2 breaker hanging over the heart of the plate. Not going to see too many of those today. Swung on and missed. Really fooled him that time for the That's first cool. down. The third base. Ready now for the White Yohan. Sox. Yohan Moncada as the switch hitter will take his cuts left-handed here. It's very difficult no, being a low. switch hitter, and very rarely do you see the same hitter from both sides of the plate. He's a far superior hitter from the left side huh? as opposed to the right side. Count one now ball, a ball and a strike. The 1-1. One, one. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. The 1-2. Oh, and this is swung on and missed. Four strikeouts already, and that's out number two. That is seven. At the plate, the Luis Robert. First two men in the inning have both gone down yeah. via the punch out, so we'll see if he can fare any better. And they go right after him on the inside corner for strike one. Ball and a strike. No score here as we play inning number two. Edge of the zone that time taken and ruled a strike. And it's two balls and two strikes now. Hit the other way out toward right field. Bellinger's in pursuit. He dives, but he can't make the play. And this one hops over the wall for a ground rule double. So now to the plate, James McCann. As he'll swing and lift a fly ball to right center. Bellinger is under it, and he makes the catch for out number three. Into the box, Brian Dozier. He'll look to get something going here in this scoreless ball game. First pitch on its way. And it's fouled away. You're lucky if you get one pitch a night right down the middle. Cannot be late on that fastball. And this is high, a ball and a strike. So that's two pitches in a row above the belt. As a hitter, that's what you're looking for, especially when it's a day game. It's a high fly ball headed for the left field corner. If it stays fair, it's gone. Nearly a big fly to start the inning instead of foul ball. And he lays off a pitch outside as they draw even at two and two. Did a good job to shorten up and protect the plate, and he'll have another shot at it here. Another try at 2 2. Left center, base hit. This will kick up against the wall now. And a good start to the inning for the Rangers. It's going to be a leadoff double. Batting fifth, the first base baby. Into the box now, Ronald Guzman, no, no. as he lays off a fastball too low for ball one. That evens it up, one and one. A ball and two strikes. One and two. I can't imagine he was sitting on fastball at his neck right there. He is going to have to lower his sights if he's going to have oh, any chance. Oh. Now a good pitch around the knees, but it doesn't quite catch the bottom of the zone. The 2-2. Still hanging with him. Another good swing to keep it going. 
It's going to be back to some serious T work if he can't put that pitch in play right in his wheelhouse. Oh, and they really bunch him up on that one as he swings and misses for the first out. Batting cut. And now is Yasiel Puig. Yapiel. He's set. Here it comes. And a fastball to start things out here. Not okay. close. It's a ball and no strikes. A one and one count to Puig. Ready to deal. Here's the one one. Oh, they have him looking awfully confused up there right now. It's one and two. Made him look silly with that one. Popped him up. Sanchez backs up and takes care of it. Two away. Into the box now. Shea Lang Lears. Runner in scoring position with Sugan. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Hits this one hard the other way. Abreu will take this one over to first, and with that, the inning ends. Standing in, Cody Hosey, and he'll start out their half of the third, top of the order to follow. Cody First pitch coming, here it is. Now the pitch. Lays oh. off the slider and it's one and one. Now a ball swung on and heading for the stands in right and that'll move the count to one and two now. He's got that certainly timed up now. I'd be shocked if the pitcher goes to the well three, three. times in a row with off speed. Now a change of locks him up as he looks at strike three called now one away. The top top. Him. Anderson. First pitch of the at bat on its way. Tim Anderson comes on with one gone here as he looks at a called strike one. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. Checked his swing there. Did he go around? No, says the first base umpire. Ball one. The 1 1 home. Grounded up the first baseline, but a foul ball, 1 and 2 now. Pitch on the way. No, that's a ball. Wow, that was a close pitch on one and two. The count's now at two and two, but boy, that one very easily could have been called strike three. Really close pitch. Langoliers is there. Two gone. So now bases are empty here with two base. gone. And moving Yomer. into the batter's box next Sanchez. will be Yomer Sanchez. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And that's in there for strike one. Now a flare out toward right center. In comes Bellinger, but he won't get there. It falls in. Now batter. The first baseman. Jose. A player. So here's the slugging first baseman Jose Abreu now. Bullet back up the middle. And he will get there as he had to cover a lot of ground to make that play. And that ends the inning. Bottom of the inning now. And set to go is the third baseman Isaiah Kiner Falefa. The third baseman Isaiah. First pitch coming. Here it is. Strike taken up in the zone. That elevated fastball right there, that is the biggest change in the game today for me. When I oh. first came up, a lot of guys working that One Greg Maddox east to west. Hit out towards second. Oh, and it eats him up a bit. Up next to the Rangers. In now, Albert Perez. Albert. And he hits it hard to the right side. And that's through for a base hit. Make him one for two in this one. And that runner will go no further than second as there are two aboard now. At the plate now, Julio Pablo Martinez. As he takes a cold strike on the black, it's 0-1. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Hey, you know the pitcher right now, he's looking for that best friend, that double play ball. This is where you have to really be disciplined at the plate and make sure that you get a pitch that's above the knee so you can get in the air. Count still at one and two. Oh. 
Now a ball grounded to short. This could be two. Wow, the throw pulls him off the bag. The batter, the batter David Hitter. To the plate now, Dominic Smith, as he'll pop this one foul off to the left and out of play. A one pitch on its way. Chopper to short. Anderson scoops it up to second for one. Back to first, so they get the double play, but the run does come in to score. So two are gone here in the Rangers' third, and that brings in the former National League Rookie of the Year, Cody Bellinger. First pitch on its way. Perez at third with two away. Oh, and this ball is absolutely blasted. High and deep. And out of here. And I mean by plenty. That ball was crushed. Man, you could tell by the sound of that one off the bat. That was going a long way. Ryan Dozier at the plate. As the first no. pitch to him is off the plate for a ball 1-0. and oh. It was a double for him in his first turn at the plate. Uh, needed to lay off one that one. pitch upstairs, but it's 1-1. One and one. Now here's the pitch. Swing and a hard liner to center field. That's in another base hit. He's 2-2. Two for two. At the plate, Ronald Guzman, as he will take strike one on the fastball here. No balls and a strike. Pulled toward right center field. Center fielder on the run. He's there to track it down, and that'll end the inning. Riding in once again, Eloy Jimenez looking to put the ball in play here. He went down on strikes in his first at bat. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. Starts him with a good rising fastball there for strike one. Fouled off. And he fouls this one off. The 0 2 once more. Now the fastball is right by him as he swings and misses for the first out of the inning. So the bases are empty with one man gone. And that'll bring up the power hitting outfielder, Trey Mancini. First offering on its way. And he'll lay off a fastball here in a good spot, but rule the ball 1 0. A good tailing fastball for a strike 1 and 1. Mancini, an imposing right handed figure at 6 foot 4 inches tall. He was an eighth round selection back in the draft of 2013. I know this guy wouldn't go into the category of superstar, but to grind out the career he has being drafted where he was, my hat's off to him. Three and one, here it is. Hey, hey he's got great feel for that pitch right there. He can throw it anytime he wants for a strike. Count remains full. No runs, three hits, and no errors so far for the White Sox. Fouled away. And he can only battle for so long as he's finally set down here after an eight pitch at bat. So bases are empty here with two gone and that'll bring up the former top prospect as a minor leaguer Johan Moncada. And he takes ball one. Well he punched out the last guy but he didn't get any favors from the blue on the first pitch in this at bat. Probably should be ahead of this hitter instead of behind. Into the corner and slicing foul. The one one home.
a little roller toward the hole. Fielded cleanly. On to first with it himself is Guzman, and the inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning. And standing in is the veteran outfielder, Yasiel Puig. One of the keys to securing the win. They want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings. One ball, no strikes to count. 2-0 the count to the Rangers' left fielder. Well, he's not proving that he can command his breaking ball in the zone right now. And until he does, there's no reason to bite on it. 3-0 to him now. And that misses for ball four. It's a leadoff walk that starts the bottom of the fourth. So next to the plate for Texas, Shea Langoliers comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. First pitch on its way. And that's in there for a strike. Takes a pitch high and away for ball one. One ball, one Three strike. runs, seven hits, and no errors in the contest for the Rangers so far. One, one and hit. two to the Rangers catcher. Fastball strike. called, three. strike three, and there's the first out of the inning. Digging in, now Isaiah Kiner Falefa. Isaiah Kiner Falefa. From the stretch. Oh. 1 0 count. Here it is. We go for second. Pitch misses low. The throw down is not in time as he just gets in ahead of the throw. 2 0 count. The pitch is swung on and missed in that strike one. Spin and a throw back to second. And a leap, but it's over his head at second. A man at third with one away. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. And another runs across as this is now a 4 0 ball game. Now back, second base into the box, Albert, Albert Perez. Perez. Line drive, and that's a base hit into center field. Matt Wisler answers the call from the pen now here back. in the fourth as they the didn't get the outing they were Julio hoping for Pablo from the starter. Martinez. Standing in now, Julio Pablo Martinez lifted down the line and left. And that will end up a foul ball. Comes set and the 0-1. Okay. Good fastball as he gets the swing and a miss. Whistler has logged upwards of 75 innings pitched and has an ERA he'd like to see come down a bit. Starts the day in the high fours. And that's going to fall for a base hit. And this will not be close, and the run will score easily. The batter, Into the box now, Just Dominic Smith, as he will look at a first pitch fastball for ball one. Well, I think he's got to find a way out of this jam and limit the damage. If he's unable to do that, this game could get away from him. Base hit, and that'll get a run in. The relay, but too late, and he's safe at third. Now back. The right Cody, Cody Bellinger at the plate now. Bellinger. He'll take a look at a pitch too low. It's ball one. one oh. High in the air out to center field. Catch made in center. Here comes the runner from third. And he will oh, get in okay. to score. And it's a run batted in on the sacrifice fly. Here's Brian Dozier now. Two hits and two trips more in thus far. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. And this one's in the dirt. And no advance. It's ball one. The 1-0 one oh delivery. If you've been paying attention, the guy on the mound does not want to come inside. If I'm at the plate, I'm leaning out over. And wow, that looked to be well inside, but it's a called strike. Two and one now. A little early, and now it's even at two and two. Four runs here in this half inning. 
outside in a full count three and two. Good spot for an RBI. Put the ball in play with the runner in motion. He could score. And we'll have to leave it there as this is strike three, and that will retire the side. So striding in, Luis Robert, one for one, as he reached base with a double his first time up. Yeah, he did a great job to go down and get that one his last at bat. But I got to think they're going to pitch him up, maybe elevate something in the zone. Interested to see how he approaches this next A.B. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Hit in the air down the right field line. But this is just going to wind up being a foul ball. And a slider runs away from him there, and the count levels at two and two. And he struck him out, and that's eight strikeouts thus far. Stepping in and ready for another shot, James McCann. He flew out in his last at bat. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. That's taken. Now it's 0 and 2. This is one of the things that makes him so effective as a pitcher. Able to pound his zone with all different options. Swing and a liner, but foul. The 0 2 once more. Is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. So to the plate is the White Sox DH. Cody Hosey. First time up, he went Cody. down looking. Yeah, and they Hosey. froze him on a good change up. Tough one. If you got good arm action, and this pitcher certainly does have good arm action out there, tough to decipher between the fastball and changeup. He's got to be willing to stay back and one take ball. the ball the one other strike. way. One and one the count. Now here's the pitch. Whew. Two out, nobody on. Grounded back up the middle. Throw on to Guzman at first, and the inning is over. Stepping into the box, Ronald Guzman. Wolf for two on his line thus far. The first baseman, Ronald. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Swing and he pops him up. Jimenez coming in, but he won't get to it, and this should put a man in scoring position to start the inning. And he'll pull into second here with nobody out. Now batting, no outfielder, Yasiel. Next to bat will be Yasiel Puig, as he'll take a look at ball one. One ball, no strike. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. Maybe a bit of an overthrow there, guys. May have let that front side open up a little early to try to pump up on a fastball and there sailed it. on it. And the throw to first is in time. One gone. Up next for the Rangers, now Shea Langelier. 0 for 2 for okay. him to this point. Langelier. First pitch of the at-bat. Runner at second here with one man out. Check swing, oh, but he held oh. up in time. Ball one. One and two now as that one's fouled off. Has a look, now the pitch. And a slider's in the dirt as he lays off it for a ball. Line towards center field. And that's in there. Base hit. Guzman rounds the corner and is headed home. And he's, no, he's safe back. at the plate as they push their lead to eight now. Now batter, third baseman. So now up steps Isaiah, Isaiah Kiner Falefa as he tries to go out and get the slider, but it's not there. It's strike one. Swing and a liner. But foul. Here it comes on nothing and two. Grounded down the third baseline. 
But this will be a foul ball, and it's still 0-2. And this is popped up near second base. Sanchez has a play. He hauls it in without any trouble. And there are two away. Now Digging in and looking for more. Albert Perez. Albert. He singled his Albert. last time up. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Oh. One one is taken for ball two. Now a swing going oh, out over in the third base dugout as that thing nearly took out half the coaching staff. Neither guy willing to give in, and the at bat will continue. The two two one more time. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Here comes Mancini. He makes the catch. What a play on the run to end the inning. And that'll bring up the shortstop, Tim Anderson. He's 0 for 2 with a strikeout in this one. This one doesn't look good so far. Down by a boatload as we enter the middle innings. It's about time they get something going. And the last thing you want to do is fall behind where you have to score a bunch in the eighth and ninth inning. Tried to get him to go after the slider, but it's one and one. Counts a ball and two strikes to the White one Sox ball. shortstop. With the way this guy's throwing on the mound, you cannot be chasing. You have to set your sights a little bit lower and control the strike zone. Swing and a foul tip, but that's held onto behind the plate. It's a strikeout for route now number batter. one. The second baseman. One out for Yomer Chicago here in the Sanchez. sixth. And moving into the batter's box next will be Yomer Sanchez. And he misses inside, inside with that one. Ball one. And a strike to even the count. Now here's the pitch. Ball two. Man, this guy has retired a whole slew right now. I think what he needs to do is just stay focused and keep attacking the game plan like he has up to this point because everything he's done has worked. The 2-2. Two -two. Is swung on and missed strike three. Digging in once again, Jose Abreu. He's grounded out and lined Jose out in two trips. Abreu. First pitch of the at bat on its way. And he just keeps rolling along as he starts another batter out with strike one. You know, over the course of a full season, you're going to have some clunkers, and this certainly looks like one. By the look on the manager's face, he's going to probably call a meeting after this. And it's fouled away. Here comes another 0 2. Here's a swing and a ground ball. Now batting the left fielder. Eloy. Stepping in now, Eloy Jimenez. Jimenez. As he oh, looks at a fastball that misses off the plate for ball one. He's 0 for 2 in the ball game so far. The 1 0. Is a fastball no, taken high for a ball. A couple strikeouts early in the game, but he's done a much better job in this at bat trying to get ahead and put himself at a good hitter's count. Hit hard back up the middle. That's through, and he's got his first base hit. He's one for three. Now batting, right fielder. And Ray. here's the big right handed power Ray. threat, Trey Mancini. He's got it. And the two out threat will not come to pass as the inning is over. Striding in, Julio Pablo Martinez. It was an RBI single for him in his last plate appearance. Julio Pablo. He's ready. Here's the first offering. He pulls this one into right. But this is right at him in right field as he hardly has to move to take it in for the first out. 
Next will be the designated hitter, Dominic Smith. Singled home a run in his last time up. First delivery to him on the way. High in the air out to center field. Center fielder on the run. He's got it. A nice play there. Two away. So two away for the Rangers here in the sixth. And that'll bring forward Cody Bellinger. Here comes the first pitch. Bases are empty here with two men out. Fastball right back to the mound. And he'll flip it onto first, and with it, that ends the inning. Juan Nicasio is on to pitch from the bullpen now to start inning number seven. Number 43. Seventh inning ready to roll, and that'll bring up the former top prospect as a minor leaguer, Yoan Moncada. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. And he takes a pitch that's ruled a strike at the knees. Pretty liberal strike zone there. It's 0-1. Gets the fastball by him here, and he's in control 0-2. Nothing in two count, and the pitch. Might have been looking to find that outside corner, but he couldn't quite get it there. It's one and two. Just hung in there on that one. Again, a one two. Hit weakly back to the mound. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. Now Ready back. once again, Luis Rubber. He was sat down on strikes in his last at bat. First pitch on its way. Huh. Nicasio, a six foot four inch right hander. He's currently in the first year of a new two year contract. I notice ain't a ton of job security, but it's certainly better than a one year deal. A two to three year deal puts yourself in a position where you can really invest in this team. Number 33. So digging in now, James McCann. McCann. He looked to bounce back after striking out his last time up. Off the plate and away there. One ball, no strikes. And he won't bite at that one either. It's 2-0. Oh. Hey, you want to talk about being in a zone? This guy's been raking lately. And it all starts with his pitch selection. Two great takes, and he's almost daring the pitcher. Just go ahead and challenge him. Gets the sign. Here comes the 2-1. And he comes back with a gorgeous slider there for strike two. And a full count for James McCann. Three balls and two strikes. Cody Hosey would be next. Hit to third. Oh, and he can't come up with it. And they'll have no play as he reaches first base safely. Now batter, the designated hitter. Cody and now Cody Hosey. Hosey. As the first pitch misses to him, it's ball one. No hits to this point. A high strike there, and it's one and one. And he lays off for a ball, two and one. Popped him up. Guzman in foul ground. And that's the third out. Ladies and gentlemen, it's time for the traditional seventh inning serve. Stepping up now, Brian Dozier. Two for three with a double on his line so far. Outfield shaded a bit to left center, the first pitch. The 1-0. Hot shot to third and handled for the first out. So striding forward now, Ronald Guzman. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, it's been an offensive explosion for him today. There's a fight at the bat rack. Everyone seems to be putting barrel on baseball in this lineup. And it's quickly 0-2. That misses, says the home plate umpire. One and two. Where it misses, I'm not quite sure. 
Now a ball lined toward the gap in left center. And he will make the play out there, and there are two away now. now Standing back. in, Yasiel Puig. Yasiel. 0 for 2 with a walk for him so far. First pitch of the at-bat on its way. Bullet back up the middle. But this will not get down quickly enough as it's pulled in out there in center, and that ends the inning. So the lineup flips over and digging in, Tim Anderson. He went down on strikes last time up. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. Probably a design take right there. They need base runners, so they're going to make them try to bring the ball in the strike zone. Martinez is there, and he has it for the first out. Digging in the switch hitter, Yomer Sanchez. He struck out swinging in his last trip to the plate. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something this A.B. On to first, and he's breezing through the eighth here with two quick outs. Digging in to try it again, Jose Abreu. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. First pitch of the at-bat. This is line to left, and he dives to make a spectacular catch. What a play there to end the inning. Bottom of inning number eight set to go, and next to hit is the catcher, Shea Langoliers. First pitch on its way. On a line, that's a base hit. So that puts the leadoff man aboard to get the inning underway. Now batting, third baseman. So now to the plate, Isaiah Kiner Falefa. As the first pitch to him is swung on and missed for strike one. Mm, got him out on his front foot. It's 0 and 2. That's back to back sliders on the outside part of the plate. Now would be a good time to come in with that good hard stuff inside. Now this is slowly hit to short, probably too slowly to get to. And indeed he won't look at second. He'll just flip it on over to first to take the sure out. Cody Hoyer comes on to pitch now, hoping for better results than the other arms that they've run out there in this one. Albert Perez will be his first assignment out of the bullpen as he'll stand in with a runner in scoring position at second and one away. And here's a slider that's nowhere close, and it's 1-0. and Inside, and he falls behind the hitter now, 2-0. and I don't mind him trying to pitch him backwards right there with those two early count sliders, but now he finds himself in a situation where he's going to have to come fastball. From the belt, kicks and deals. Almost got him to go around, but instead it's ball three. One strike. And he misses ball four. So he comes out of the bullpen and immediately walks the first man he faces. Stepping in, Julio Pablo Martinez. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Way behind that pitch. It's 0-1. Hit on the ground down the first baseline. But oh. this will be a foul ball as he's behind 0-2 now. And look out as that one ran in and got him. Now with the plate, Dominic Smith. He's doubled and singled in four at-bats in this contest. From the stretch, here's the pitch. And he jumps at a changeup, a swing and a miss. Breaking ball below the zone. That's ball one. He came into a mess out of the bullpen, and it hasn't gotten any better. This is not a comfortable place to be. Not even close. The second for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Now it'll be the four-hole hitter, Eloy Jimenez. And his guys need him to get things started here in the top Eloy half of the ninth. Jimenez. First delivery to him on the way. Strike. No ball. One strike. Ready with the nothing in one pitch. Squared that one up just a little late. 
Here comes the 0-2 pitch. There's a shin-high slider laid off for a ball. And two and two. The pitch. Lifted down the line and left. And this is going to wind up a foul ball. The 2-2 one more time. These are the kind of A-Bs, regardless of the outcome, you go back to the dugout as an offensive player, and your teammates are loving on you for making that pitcher work and battling it out. The 3-2 one more time. Got him! And he goes down on strikes for the third time. Ready now, Trey Mancini. He was retired via the ground ball last time up. He's set, and the pitch. Nope, that's low. He may be down 2-0 and after those first two pitches in this A-B, but those are pitches he can feel pretty good about. They did miss by a whole lot, so it's not like he's all over the place. And he'll stay with it to put it away as they get their man here for the second out. Next to bat will be the Cuban import, Yohan Moncada. Yohan Moncada. Here comes the first pitch. High and deep down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Two out, nobody on. Swing and a miss, okay. and they're up against it now as they're down to their final strike of the afternoon. The White Sox down to their last strike. And he missed with it. It's one and two. Now what's left of this crowd this afternoon gets to their feet. Fouled off. Hey, that fastball caught too much of the plate on an 0-2 count. One strike from a shutout. Here it comes. Swing and a miss. He struck him out, and that'll do it here as the ball game is over. Four wins in a row for these guys, and I'm sure they're feeling pretty good about themselves. We'll see how long they can keep this up. Eight nothing the final today. The Rangers led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Luis Severino earns a league best 17th victory, picking up 11 strikeouts along the way. Spencer Turnbull struggled and gets the loss after giving up six earned. Juan Nicasio takes the rare three inning save, his first of the year. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Klesak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vasquez, and you've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. The final line score for our ball game this afternoon. First for the victorious Rangers, eight runs on 14 hits.